Hello everyone, this is Nancy. Welcome back to a Glitter Cecily and Such live tutorials brought to you every single day except Sunday. And a welcome back. Happy Monday. Hope everyone have a great time. Hi Janie, how are you? Thanks so much for tuning in. Hi, a little beauty. Hi KG. Hi Divai. Hey Nell by Honey. Salaza, hey, SD, thanks so much for tuning in. If you missed my live video on Saturday, please tune in back in. I don't know if the story time will last, but also is following up uh, with really short clips. And some of the clips are getting really um, clear, but some of them are missing any step. Feel free to DM us or head over to uh, YouTube channel to watch full live tutorial so if you still have any question regarding to the techniques feel free to dm us or comments on uh the post and also you can get uh support from us at info at glitzaccessoryandsuch.com and you also can call us at 206-771-5086 if you have any question regarding to your order your products so welcome back today i uh hey Dennis from Jamaica, thank you so much. Hi, Fancy Finger. Hello, Mary to Mexicans. Thanks so much for tuning in. Just I just saw the post earlier, not too long ago, regarding to 20K followers giveaway. Yay! It's great. Hey, Vicky. Thank you to all of you. It's on behalf of Glissa, Cecily, and such, and the whole entire teams. A lot of us will be behind the scenes you don't get to see, just only like me and Vicky and Brad uh, on the team doing live video. Is They all bringing the passion, the love, and the support to you. So please, you are, if you are on Instagram, just show the support back to them. Follow them at Vicky at Vicky. Jensen's also Brad, uh, designed by Brad. All the people who behind the scene to would love to share with you from even from a beginner to advanced. They're all really working hard. So we uh, will would love to give them a support back. And tonight I'm going live. Hi Miss Sandy. Hi Sophia. How are you? Thanks so much for tuning in. Don't forget to enter to win 20k followers giveaway. So we love all of you. We wouldn't be here without every single of you. So thank you so much for the love and support. That's why we would love to always want to give back to community, to all the nail techs, all fellows. So just enjoy and good luck with everyone. Just make sure you follow all the steps and uh, you're going to get a chance to win. So I'm so excited. Can't wait to see who's the winner. And good luck, everyone. And you can enter, I believe... I didn't get to read all that uh, information, but please follow that. All information is on the uh, caption and the comments, so don't miss any step because you miss it, you miss the chance to enter to win. So, hi Roxy, hello. Thanks so much everyone. Tonight's gonna have a great um, contents. Every time I prepare a good, like at least four to five different nails, because it's never like, um, I think it's never end to me. It's like an endless to come to Crystal and all the nail art. You don't have to be a top of the line nail artist to be able to do a great job. Like do with the passion, you know. Sometimes we we'll look at a different other nail tech. We feel really discouraged because you think that you're not good enough. Absolutely, you are really good. Just in a different, everybody different of um, stage, different level. It means you are just starting out and you look at someone for 20 years, 30 years, or even like one or two years, you think you are not good enough. You're absolutely really good. Just keep up what you're doing and keep doing what you're doing. So then you can be achieve, um, you know, something really similar or even better. So don't hesitate to... Um, Comment, DM us if you want to ask any questions, uh, and we try to get back to you if possible. Lily, come join us. Lily's just here. Hey, Miss Corina. Oh, you got already got your name in the giveaway. Yeah, thank you so much, and good luck, okay? Just follow all the steps. Don't miss any step because then it miss chance to win because they are counting every single enter. It's crazy. He's <laughs> like entering so many hundreds. 
join me here. Is Lily here? Lily just on the other day was really good live video. She said, "Oh my God, it's tough, man. It's like get to talk to everyone, look at all different comments, and get to show them like." It s make me anxious. I said, like, yeah, it take a lot for us to be in here to get to share with you. So because we love you so much, your support, it mean a lot to us. We just wanna saying it because we mean it, and we really passionate about this and everything else. When you do in life, including you are a nail technician, a nails um, Nali. Uh, sweetie, if you are uh, going to the post, I think it's a post have uh, right now they have the, I just saw the post it's up on the 20k follower. So if you doing um, the giveaway, go in the post and you enter it in the post it tell you all uh, details and how to enter. So please check on the post later after the live video too. Hey Jada, how are you? Hey, Nekwasia, how are you? Thank you so much. And today we're gonna go back with a lot of different cool things. I can't wait to share with all of you. We are going to do again, as I mentioned, another video with uh, mix bags, talking about collectible mix bag. This is one of the collectible mix bag. It's getting better and better as you know a year go by time go by there are more products coming in so the mix collectible mix bag like say right now i'm holding is um muddy grass so this is a muddy grass thank you is hi lily she was tuning in so this is muddy grass so if you're down in the south it's the seasons for muddy grass celebrates is a really a big things about you know uh, muddy grass down in south so a lot of plants gonna start getting so many cool things so um or even like the clans from in even i used to live in northwest and people were going down to south to celebrate it so just in case you just never heard about this or you start like uh, doing it with the nail art so it's something idea for your clients as well so when i'm playing some of designs cool right here for you already but also we continue doing it as well along with valentine so i'm still want to do valentine because valentine not here yet even though we've been like doing for almost like two months a different valentine to support all of you and also we are going to do some of kind of um it's kind of muddy grass but with the pigment so can i get the um purple the purple pigment and then also what we're going to do is really cute this is also can be springs can be a muddy grass is diamond dust pixie they are so cute and it's super easy to do i promise you will never go wrong with this so Let's go into some cute nails. Let's do with this one though. What are we gonna do with this? Oh, I have that laid down. You know what? I have it laid down because I am going to using this to doing it fusion ink. And we do fusion ink. Plus that we are going to put some of uh, Mardi Gras. I picked some of Mardi Gras elements over here. So then I can show you with all different technique. Uh, I'm gonna get some of gel painting. Let's do, can I get the gel painting in a go right here? So I'm gonna go ahead and do that with the fusion ink. And with fusion ink, for all the beginners, you will never, I promise, you will never go wrong with this. So if you even use one solid color, been, last two weeks, I've been sharing one solid color. So then you can catch up really quick, fast, and easy to do it without heritage, without feeling like, oh my God, it's so hard. And I keep adding up more colors and it keep bleeding like each other. So then just don't um, overwhelming with that. Just do one solid colors, you will get it down. And then when you start playing with the one colors, you feel really comfortable with this and then move to the next colors. So I'm gonna do is really pigmented if you will get one of our um, fusioning, like a marbling, you are seeing it's so pigmented. Like you just get a little bit, and you see that how it just, just, um, just little dab in it is already mixed so much pigment. And I have what underneath I have a two coat of light yellow and then I put the matte top coat on the top of 
the colors here's a matte top coat i love this matte top coat we have two kind one is a regular matte top coat and the other one is premium matte top coat it's like a super matte suede so after i done with just that few drop of fusion ink which is like a similar to marble ink and then i am going to use this is crystal clear this is awesome solution for all of you who is been a beginner like with me a first time i playing with fusioning i have the same as the same issue too like shame tr troubleshooting like say why is bleed is bleeding completely it's blurry and i never get it right because i use too much too much of either ink or too much of the solution crystal clear so only you need it just little and this depends on how you want to do your line. If you want to do your veins in a different. I'm going to get the piece of paper. Make sure you wipe after I um, apply the crystal clear. I'm going to wipe my brush. I'm showing right here. Wipe my brush. Right? So then the brush from like purple residues here is going to be clean. So before I dip my brush back into the crystal clear you know at first i get a really hard time like i don't know how i can do this and it's just so much um bleeding it's bleed all my color what happened what the heck i did it and all my color is gone because i over saturate my uh, fusioning so therefore it just really Hard to do that so just do it just gentle you don't have to use it too much you can see that how I doing it is not much and it's really depend on how you want to uh, draw your vein so if you're seeing it's on my side I wipe my brush off every time And if you do this, okay, is one of the things is really important. Always advise your clients. Like if they show you some picture of gorgeous of the nails on like social media, for instance, like Instagram, Pinterest, because they have a lot of like an ideas um, to challenge you, which is just great because then they bring a lot of great idea to your station. But then just advise them that every single um, fusioning uh, look or marble look is not none of them are identical so i can do something similar like this but i'm not gonna guarantee it's gonna be exactly the same because they are like a uh, fingerprints they can't be identical like the same so if you are you know consult with your clients at first like this i think it will be everybody going to be in the same page this is a great tip and trick that when you talk to your clients so then they won't being like really uh surprised or shocked like oh i expect to be this but it doesn't turn out this you can't control pretty much fusioning so that's why i was saying like you know if you can tell the clients um so then that way they won't you know be surprised how did you spend the weekend great we have a great time i took the kids to eat and went to the beach and chills. We didn't watch. Um, we didn't watch Super Bowl though because I took the kids to the beach and enjoy with them. So yes, my weekend is great. Hope you guys have a nice weekend as well. Hi, AC makeup. How are you? So great. If I'm happy with this, it doesn't need to be here under the LED lamp. So I'm gonna add some cool thing um, on this because I am gonna apply some of the crystal placement on. So I'm gonna using. Um, my gel painting if you watch my live video and some like a video i did put the chanfer foil and i put the chanfer foil underneath of it which is you can do it as well but i want to do some um painting gel so i have this one is golden touch i think uh, this is the colors I am going to use so you can use either ones I just want a little bit soft look, but if you're using um, Chanfer foil if you're using this Premium chanfer foils and apply the foil on it looks great too, but then it's gonna look a little bit drum dramatic So I want to soft look so I'm gonna use this uh, Golden touch and just draw just a little bit of my veins 
because I'm going to apply the crystal on it so I don't want to be too crazy with that but if you want to like getting the foil in I think you can do that as well I think it looks cute really cute though it's really depend on your clients if they want it to do it for them don't limit of your uh, potential you can do pretty much anything I wouldn't say whatever clients only I can't do identical like I can do like inspiration from a nail artist but I can't really like doing a copy exact the same because you know it's everything is gonna be probably different you know why because sometimes a client's bringing a picture is great to have inspired but then sometime here's I say sometime like the shape and the structure of the clients it, they are not the same like the one on the pictures will be like really slender and their finger is so a uh, model nails and then here your clients have a shorter nail bed so it just have to be depend and you have to explain it to them how why is different so why is her nail look so slender and nice and my nail it doesn't look like that it's just you have to let them know all right so i think i'm happy with this i just want a soft touch of the veins and I'm gonna pop this in the lamp for about 60 seconds so then I'm going with my uh, crystal placement. All right, put it in, 60 seconds. Thank you so much everyone for tuning in tonight. Don't forget to, after you end video, don't forget to enter to win the giveaway. I think it's such a great giveaway. I'm seeing this, the notes right here. It's gonna be two winners. Two winners, everyone, for each one for uh, Instagram and one for Facebook. It's so excited. We always want to make sure that two platforms get each winner. And this time, each winner will win $500 of special glitch treasure box. So you see 500 is we have uh, the winner will pass 10,000. They're so excited and happy. It's a lot of really good products sent to you in that box. So don't forget to enter to win and don't lose the chance to win. Uh, the giveaway and have fun everyone and good luck thanks Jada thanks so much AC makeup what's your name Jada it's my name Nancy Jada if you didn't catch it at the first beginning SWT bye hello how are you it's all great with this I am gonna going right into can I get the condensed glue gel I'm gonna go in with the condensed glue gel. As you um, have been watching a lot of my live videos, I always use this and it's only the really keys, really, really secret in the keys to have the crystal placement. And we have a lot of questions regarding to this, how much you should apply for this? How much is enough? When you apply for this, and you might notice that our glue, glue gel is a little bit thick density, which is normal. And what you need to do is you just need to apply generous even you don't want to be too thin but you don't want to be too thick too thick is gonna flood your crystal it probably give you one or two try to get it's really really cool down so make sure you don't want to use it too much and don't want to use too little too little your crystal easy to pop up too much to gonna flood your crystal so I will using a right amount and I'm applying this whole entire the nails because I'm going to do a crystal on certain different uh, place. No wipe top coat. And I haven't cured my condensed glue gel yet. I'm going to do that after I finish with my crystal placement. So you're going to float it on the top. You see my technique really quick and fast and float it on because I don't want to pull off my condensed glue gel. This technique is really cool. It's going to finish. Then your nails will not have residue and plus there's going to grab the crystal base in one place. So I'm going to place right in the middle because the, the fusioning is so beautiful. I do not want to like cover them like completely. So I'm going to just like try to work along with that without like cover completely. And like, I'm going to try to get this one right there and this. It's going to look really good. This is going to be awesome. Like you don't have to be exactly the same. This is like for, um, 
Mardi's Grass Mix Bag. Also, you can use swap this color to the pink and the red. You can turn out really, really beautiful as Valentine nails. I promise you uh, play with this and you can see the difference. I'm going to put a couple of uh, Dragon Scale in it. This Dragon Scale is so freaking cute. This goes with pretty much everything. If you want more, you can put it more in there. But if you want just one or two, just for the accent, they go so well together. I just don't want a too overpower of it. Let me um get a couple of the beads right there. I think I don't need. I don't think I need any beads. I can. But then because you know why, because the uh, veins that I put earlier, it looks so pretty already. So I want this one to standing out. Thank you so much, everyone, for tuning in today. I'm so excited. It's happy Monday. We got so uh, much fun stuff that to share with you. This nail is so cute. This one we did like... A lot of cool fun things I'm gonna I have this too cute frame right here I'm gonna put it right there I have Lily next to me and I don't know I'm gonna check with Lily's one Lily is gonna be a next live view she's like really learned so much from she's one of our students and she's so uh, passionate about sharing with people I'm gonna put some oh. it looks so it looks good it looks um a lot of bling to me I think I think I'm good though so I don't want to do too much more because it's that if it I do more it's gonna start getting busy and it take away from my marble underneath so I'm gonna pop this guy in the lamp for about 60 seconds. Looks great. And we're gonna turn, um, when we get it back, we're gonna put um, precision glue to double secure. Look at that. I still have a lot of elements in there. I can't wait. Look at that, another school. We have it last time. Uh, can I get that nails if out? Uh, one of the nails there. I'm making a color chart for that. You can pull that one out. This is so much fun. I can't wait to do like another school. And then this is a great 3D and on the natural stones and the marbles mix. So when you get the mix, uh, collectible mix pack, they are uh, totally is mega mix. So they'll come, it's getting different, it's get better and better because it's... The, as the trends go by, there are more new products. So you always get a new product in your mix bag. So like if you get your mix bag since last year or last few months and then this new mix bag come in, it's different. So or it still have some main elements. Like say, if it uh, Valentine well, last year, you always get your hearts and everything. And then this year you get that. And then plus you get a new uh, elements, new crystals in. So it's really exciting. You will never like... You never go left behind and you will never go wrong with that. So this one is all on Saturday I did. And this one is today we did. So it's really cool for uh, Mardi Gras though. It's other go in. Okay, so let me using one of a uh, best best friends of crystal is precision glue. I am going to using this and I go check like I feel scratchy right here I'm gonna squeeze just a little bit each time you do is squeeze just a little bit then one of the really good news so if any of you that have been using our precision glue for a long time and you just get one item you need to pick up from uh, us you can also now can shop on Amazon and if you have the prime membership you can get the Amazon Prime shipped to your door two days for free of charge, which is awesome. So you can get it from us or you can get it from Amazon. Either way is work. It's great. I'm so excited. 
and I'm gonna go to each different edges of and a gap and a fill in to any gap between the crystal. If you don't feel scratchy, it means your crystal seals really well. But if you feel with it, then you just squeeze just a little bit of, of uh, condensed glue gels and good. And then if you cure this, you make sure you cure flat nails for 10 seconds first. And then the rest of the time you ask your clients rock the client, uh, your fingers back and forth. The reason it is, I'm gonna pop this in the lamp for 60 seconds I'll explain it to you. Because when you turn it back and forth, so on the side of the left side, right side on the edges, the LED, you know, is will kill completely. So then it's really rare chance you get your nails is not like your crystal will knock off unless you really like abuse it. I say abuse it, I mean like you use your hands a lot for your labors that you have to use all, all. Otherwise, it's not gonna pop up unless you really like really really mistreated it. So Close the cap. Do not lose this red cap because this red cap will save you a long way Oops, It's far away. You can't see that And also you can get this on from Amazon Prime if you have the primes also we have the uh, Distributors is local in Pensacola, Florida if you are uh, living closer to a location you can also shop with them as well is uh, nail co wholesale so you can get the products from them as well then I send you in a private class nail class I did today hope you thank you Jada just send us the information thank you Vicky thank you this one you love this yellow one this all from a uh, Mardi Gras mix bag. And you can do it any, like you don't have to do it. This is the theme of Mardi Gras, which is we do a lot of uh, different cool nail art is prepared for you because we're thinking of you for all the beginners. Like if you don't know what to get or if you have a hard time to pick, oh my God, so which one should I put it together to look decent? We already did it for you. So then from there you can branch out so many different techniques. All right, we're finished with this, the first one. Let's move on to the next one. It's so cute. It is so body grass. Vicky, we need to get this done when we go to New Orleans again. We was in a haunted block. She gonna tell you all about that. It's like she was sharing, you see, and all her posts with haunted. It's amazing. It's like so, so fun, but also so scary. So I have this one, so we're gonna do it, you know, with uh, the Valentine, or we can, oh, let me share with you this. This is gonna make it so much fun. I have the two coat of the purples, and I have a no wipe top coat, which is, I have like the no wipe top coat on already. So let's do some fun things with that, okay? So I have my weaver gels right here, which is the pure white, and let's do some uh, fun, Thing with this I have my like uh, toothpick and I'm gonna using there to make it cool techniques ready so can you see it me uh, from here so I'm gonna make sure Facebook and Instagram can see it you guys can see it make sure you okay you guys can see it all okay because I need to get this closer all right ready so you put four or five uh, toothpicks together, or however you want it, and then tape it together. And you can get like four live at the same time. Get that one. Just dip just a little bit. You don't want to get a whole lot. I'm so excited with this. Look at that. This is gonna be cool for um, Mardi Gras. Also, you can do the same thing for a Valentine too, okay? You just need to change the background to a different colors. Then you can achieve the same thing.
plate. I am gonna pop this in the lamp for just 30 seconds because I'm gonna go in back with my um, neon pigment. <gasps> so cute, okay. Put it in, 30 seconds please. And just simple like that. You can do it, just put it together. Vicky doesn't care much for this, but she said it just looks really cute and it's really easy to do as well. We love to share tips and tricks with all of you. Oh, thank you on Facebook, you are there now. Uh, you can DM, um, Jada, you can DM the information to Glissa Sessu and such, and then I can get that from there. Thank you so much, SD. Hey, Adria, thank you so much. Hey, Vicky, okay, really cool now. Maybe I need to get the yellow. Purple, yellow, which is the gold, though. gold and green, I think. Get the new one. Okay. Green. Okay. These three, I'm gonna take them a little bit away from and do this three and I'm gonna use this just get just a little bit of the pigments you don't need a whole lot of them because they're so pigmented just a little bit And that's coat underneath is purple. I applied the no wipe top coat in here for 60 seconds underneath already. And then while using the weaver gel, and I applied uh, here for only 30 seconds. So much fun. Okay, wait for that. And it's really it's up to you how many colors you want to pick because there are twelve of them. Oop, I'm gonna move that one. There are 12 different colors. You can do so many with this. You don't have to do exactly the same what I have. Great. And I'm gonna put it on the size and uh, my uh, unicorn brush. Put this one in the side. And to learn with us person, watch our classes on the website. We're going to most uh, post more soon. We have a class on sun. Yeah, Sunday. This coming Sunday, February night in New York City. Uh, is this? Uh, thank you, Vicky, for a great post. Uh, it's gonna be closing in two days. Is the last chance for you to sign up with us because we want to have enough time to prepare a lot of um, techniques and products for you to prepare for the class to be really successful. So last call, last chance to sign up today and tomorrow. So don't forget to check it out in your New York City. You'll not only learn it crystal placements, you can learn it so much experience from Patty to share with you all that technique, tip and trick, how you can uh, acquire your celebrity clients as well as how to work in a runway. And okay, so that is nice. So if you want to be finished with this now, you can. If you want to add some crystal, you also can too. Like should we do just end like now and top coat it or should we put some crystal on it. I have some crystal on it. I said who said who said crystal? I said put some crystal on it. I know I want to do something like this. I'm waiting but then I already preparing it. I don't know is it your or oh, I have something like that. Okay. Crystals. What device said crystal? Okay. Keep me press. 
We have four space left for New York. Yes, cute. How do you recommend apply crystal and the nail mat? I can't see that. Give me one second, Miss Priscilla. Condensed glue gels again. Sometimes you see us in online like this. You can see it's really like um, simple. But if you have any troubleshooting, how do you recommend apply crystal if you want the nail mat? If you want the nail mat, um, Priscilla, if you want to do a nail mat instead of you put the no wipe top coat, a shiny one, you're going to put the matte top coat, no wipes on the top. So instead of your... Um, so I'm going to put the condensed glue gels all and tie the nails because I am going to... I don't know where is my crystal to place, but I always have it like prepare. But if you are at the salon, you know that you can only work in that area or in like middle of the nails or half of the nails. You know what you're doing. You just need to apply the whole entire of that uh, spot. Just make sure you blend it nice so then it doesn't have any lumpy bumpy after you cure it. But because when I see all of you, then sometimes we come up with some cool ideas that we want to make sure that we have it covers completely the nails. So then we can uh, place a crystal wherever you ladies and gentlemen would like me to do. So Miss Priscilla, Priscilla is here the tip and trick. If you're using a uh, no white top coat, it mean that if you finish the shiny, you're going to put the no white top coat shiny. If you want to the look matte, you're going to put matte on it. So you put either ones, okay? You put the matte or the shiny. So if you want shiny, you put top shiny. If you want a matte look, you're going to put the matte top on. So I am going to put the no white This nail is so much fun though. We should wear this one to New Orleans, Vicky. We're so excited to share with you. It's just really fun. I every day have so many content that I would like to share. I'm gonna put this one. It is super don't cute. I don't know. Let me see. This is um exotic design. I love this like it looks like um what is it called this one uh, half moon okay it looks so cute though Lily you like it mm -hmm. Lily said oh I like it no I want this deep purple now But also, I want the, my AB. I want a green on it. It's so much fun to play with this. Um, never get any of um like how do i say you never like go wrong with that because everything you put it together is so mixed in and it's so go well together so do not afraid of to play with that and like if you've seen the whole uh, mix bag that you're getting and uh don't hesitate to playing with this because there's so much fun to do like i have the bar in there I know, I'm going to start getting all the fun stuff in here. Oop. Okay. Come on. Just go for me. So much fun, and I can put some bead on. Oh, I like the smaller one. Let me get some smaller one. Oh, thank you, Vicky. Vicky comments. Um. Uh, everyone, if you get chant, uh, don't forget to um, 
follow Vicky back. She's such a veteran, advanced, a long time. She's never quote herself as a veteran because she's so humble. She's always sharing a lot. I learned so much from her. I being really grateful to have her in my life. We always support one or another. And same thing, you will get exactly the same support from Vicky. And she is so much, she is my library, if whatever you can thinking of consider is. Um, and we learn so much from each other and we always support each other. And we love to be out there to support all the new uh, nail techs, which is beginner. I still consider myself news all the time because you will never stop learning. The minutes that you think you need, learn it enough, you are dying. Like because there's not much anything that you can do and you can learn anymore, and it's gonna take away from your passion if you think you are not like open to learn anything. So, no offense on anyone. I love all of you, but always a room for us to learn. That's how we keep our industry is keep going. So don't let yourself, you know, let yourself to be left behind, just catching up. And you have all of us here to being really sharing with you and helping you walk with you, you know, run with you. So don't have a test to connect to one of us. Oh, I like that. All right, see, so you see that how simple I'm say simple is mean like it's not I'm not lying at all. You're watching me doing it right now. And I'm literally watching uh okay, watching your comments and doing um the designs and share with you what I thought at the same time. And I got cute, super cute design on it. It's different, I have to say that. Take you to the next level of your design. So then when you see when you have one bag of this and put in the tray after you receive your order, I'm like, oh my goodness, okay, I know what to do with this now. You're not gonna see now, oh, what the heck, uh, what what should I do? You are not gonna have that like um, mentality or fit of like that. You're gonna like, oh great, I'm ready to rock and roll. Okay, I'm gonna pop in the lamp for 60 seconds when I'm ready. It's super cute though. It's really make a trend of uh, Mardi Gras. Also, as I say, if you change the background to the pink, and uh, I would say a light pink, and you can do this colors, like hot pink on it. So it'll make your Valentine really hot nails, like a hot date nails. So, and you can change the different colors. Like if you get one of the Valentine mix bag, I think it's over there. Can you see if you have Valentine? Because I've been using a Valentine like a lot. So my Valentine mix bag is gone. I need to place another order before it's gone. Oh, yeah. Some of them. But I did so many. If you see throughout my uh, live video, I still have some of them. It's so cute. I did so many. Now look at this. Uh, this one is like a lot of neon. See, now I have a few seconds to wait. Look at that. I did so many. All different designs. And then a lot of them are from mixed bag. Like this super cute one I did it before is from a mixed bag as well. You can see that. Super cute. So I'm like so obsessed with that. And another uh, really tip and trick. If you need to looking for this, it's cute for your uh, swatch holder. Go to your local hardware store at like... Home Depot, Lowe's, you can find something like this for really a good price. So you can put it with your swatch to make it look cute and stand on the station. And this one looks great. I am going to using one of the Crystal Bestie tools, which is I'm really, really happy that I got this because it's prevent from a lot of issue like catching on the client's hair, especially when you do a lot of cute detail design like this. I'm gonna squeeze just a little bit. You don't need a whole lot. You just feel it scratchy, then you are going to feel it in. Just don't, uh, you don't have to squeeze out a lot. And I'm gonna share with you right now the tip and tricks after this. Um, okay, right here, here, here. And I'm happy with it. I think I feel a lot of them, like which is all of the uh, crystals. And I am going to use my twin tip brush. And 
just give it a little swipe right there because I can see the little bit lumpy bumpy here because I have the extra con uh, precision glue so I'm gonna blend it nicely so then that's way they are going to blend nicely great pop in the lamp for 60 seconds and this nail is gonna be completely done but However, if the clients get the nails out and they feel any scratchy, any spot, you can fill them in again, okay? And cure it. Yes, Miss Priscilla, we have the matte top coat. This one right there. I love this matte top coat. When you painted it on, when you polish it on, it's like turn sway right away so it's not like shiny it's never come back to shiny with you and it's gonna get really easy to work with perfect for painting matte finish and um anything that you would do or 40 so i'm gonna pop this red cap into the lamp again if you're just tuning in welcome to glitz accessory and such but if you are just need one bottle of this if you're out of this and you want to need it right away for two days we ship really fast too also so does amazon prime if you have amazon prime member you can get it from them as well uh and it ships to your door right in two days and also we have local is a uh, distributor in Pensacola at Nelco Wholesale. So if you are local, please support them. They are such a great um, distributor as well to us from a day one. Thanks so much, Divine. Keep me, keep me, in, uh, keep me pressed. Thank you so much. That weaver gel make design so easy. Yes, it is so much easier. Look at that. It's so much fun. And we did three nails already look at that it's all for you so if you're down south here you go the design from muddy grass mix bag and weaver gel with all neon pigment i'm freaking love that neon pigments well i don't know like i did all different three different techniques this one with chanfer foy ombre like different if you miss this you can see that in a really short video clip from us on um on the IG, don't forget to check it out also on uh, Facebook. And also this one, I just did it too today. So it's so much fun to do. So we have three nails, so cool and easy. And let's do this one and this. And this, I'm gonna do a Valentine that is for me to all of you. Really simple, but hey, it's for beginner, it's great. I am finished with two coat of the gel polish already and uh let me see where is my condensed glue gel here you go okay so now we have one more that is the last one for tonight that we have this for uh valentine so i'm so excited so this is going to be condensed glue gel if you first time working with our condensed glue gel is really normal when you feel it's so like a thick density okay so just blend it nicely and give it enough don't being too like if you want to do a lot of crystal then don't do it too thin but also don't do it too thick because you're gonna wasting it hey and, and henry how are you hey kathy me too i love nail coat. i don't know what to do without like no nail coats here so we'll would be panicking right so no wipe top coat if you want this in the matte top coat we can do in a matte top coat lily give me a second i'll be right with you lily i just want you lily to join us i'm gonna do it no white no wipe top just blend it great it's gonna be this one you're gonna be surprised at what is that just simple I'm promise it's really simple and you will never go wrong with this I'm gonna get my cheeky heart a little bit like a flirty heart we should saying it instead of cheeky heart I don't know why you say cheeky heart I think it's flirty but Whatever, I like it. It's 
So how do you apply the crystal to make it look good? As long as you place them tight together. The closer they are together, the better it's gonna be and it'll last longer and it will never gonna come off for you. I promise. If sometime it happened that you feel like your crystal is not staying, maybe don't forget to check your LED lamp. Or maybe during the time you might forget to tell the client to just move like around their fingers back and forth. So that's why it might be a case. I think I like that. It's so beautiful and I'm using um, this color is Scarlet's Red, I think. And the uh, Cheeky Heart. So also, for all of you who is just a beginner and just need to like pick what you should pick. Like if you want to get the products, you can check in with a uh, treasure box. But if you want to get a tool, you should check out the tri Trifecta tools. This have everything for you. So. That's it. As long as you place them really close together and you would never go wrong with that. You want to be in the beat. Your mix bag have a lot of stone. And give me one second. Corina, you said your mix bag it have a lot of stone. I got a lot of stone. Fight them harder to try to place. It means that you have a lot. And it makes you harder. So what you do, you remember that yes, uh, last Saturday I did what I did. I have a lot of stone too. So what I did, it I did a little bit different. I pour them in two tray. I don't keep them in all on one tray. So here's my tip and trick. I put them in like two tray. I pour in half of the tray, like you would doing it this. I know it's just I have the same feeling so I'm pulling half of this so only have half so then that way it's great for you to get all the ideas that you want to get try that Karina and you see it's so much better I get overwhelming too I'm telling you be honest and sometimes I feel like I get lost in that mixed bag right because we think like oh my god it's too many uh crystal but then imagine if you don't have any crystal to work on i would rather to have more instead of less so i always take more so if you like place this crystal close and tight they always stay nice and tight you happy with this leave it alone if you don't want uh to just just have the crystal like this you can also put the beads between the crystals between them and uh to kind of make them look like a jewelry i think i don't know i just like plain like this but you don't want them plain you can put the beads on it pop in the lamp for about 60 seconds should i put the beads on you can leave it like this just look i think i look like i like that I'm like, okay, let me do one time with no beat and see how it turned out. It looks so freaking cute, though. It's like just pink and red. Just leave me alone. Okay, yes, you are welcome. You space out Pensacola. Thanks so much, Vicky. It looks better like this. Okay, Cindy, I'm going to keep it like this. It looks cute, though, right? So you, you, no, what's no fancy finger? All right, so pop in the lamp for about 60 seconds. Let me go naked, no beats for one time and see how it is. Then you might look at, uh, I think I should put the beats on. That looks great. I'm really enjoying it tonight. I can't wait till tomorrow. I believe tomorrow, uh, Vicky and Brad, either of them, Brad is going live tomorrow on Tuesday and Vicky on Wednesday, right, Vicky on Wednesday? No beats. 
<laughs> I know, right? I feel naked, but I will try to see you one time. If you are beginners and you are afraid of to get so much with mess up with the beats, just try one, just plain, just close, make them close tight together. Put them close together. And then well, next tomorrow, we're going to do some much, so much more fun thing. I'm going to work with this frame tomorrow. I have it prepared, so then I have it tomorrow. So, like, okay, so Miss Karina, right? So, when you see this, like, when you get that in your bag, in the jar, you pull it out, it's so overwhelming because you can't see anything. I usually get two tray and I have one out. And I pull it, like, just a little bit. So now you start seeing a lot of different elements here without no overwhelming. Like I have frame, I have like all different arrows, so it's great to work with. But don't overwhelm yourself by having too many products. You can pour it in the two different tray. I'm gonna do, what I'm gonna do is finishing this one with precision glue because I feel a little bit scratchy here. I usually I feel it first before I squeeze anything out. And then if you feel it really smoothly already, it means that it's good. You don't need to add anything else in. But if I feel scratchy, it means that it's neat. Like right here, I know it's scratchy because the uh, um, crystal need to be feel on the edges. And don't forget to ask the clients rock their finger back and forth to make sure they are completely clear for 360 degree. It means that any edges of the crystals. So we're so excited. I think I got it good. Pop in the lamp for about 60 seconds and this nail are completely done. Oh, it looks so super cute though. And I might have some wax residue. I'm gonna wipe it off with my alcohol um, and then this nail gonna be done. I'm really enjoying it tonight and Monday night. Thank you so much everyone for tuning in. Don't forget to check out the class in New York City. We're closing the class registrations and like tomorrow and we have few seats left. So don't forget to uh, check them out and the link to the class in the bios. You're going to see the categories in classes in there and also stay tuned for is ambassador class training with the whole entire the uh, training course coming. Good night, Vicky. Hold on. I have to go back to the salon. Oh, great. Thank you, Vicky. I can't wait. So we're going to definitely... Yes, Vicky will go live on Wednesday. So don't forget to follow the, follow her on uh, Wednesday. Uh, on Wednesday, Vicky going to go live. And... Thank you, True Jennings. Tomorrow, come back. We're going to do is really cool this. Uh, Diamond Dust Pixie. I can't wait. This nail are completely done. And then we have... We did a lot today. We did like really good nails. Three really good nails tonight. And don't forget to checking out of giveaway. And then also... I will see you tomorrow night for another live tutorial. Thank you so much, everyone. Don't forget to enter the giveaway. 20K giveaway is 10, 20K follower giveaway is such a big giveaway. So don't, don't forget to enter to win. And any question, you can DM us and call us as well as uh, email us. And there's really cute a treasure box going on for Valentine. Everything you find in there will be a Valentine theme. If you are like don't know what to get, to get that uh, treasure box. I think it's such a great idea. And you save so much money on there. How do we share on Instagram? Is Kathy, there are, if you have an app, which is the repost app, you can repost it. Download the repost app for Instagram and you can repost it. If you don't, don't worry. You just need to, only the fastest way I share with everyone, just screenshot that post and repost it to your page. So you can just screenshot it and then repost it to your page. Or you can download the video uh, you can download the apps and um, the re app repost. Also, uh, don't forget to, when you repost it, tag a glitz accessory and such. Great. Thank you so much, everyone. I have a great night tonight, and we'll definitely see you tomorrow. Bye bye.